شهر رمضان الذي أنزل فيه القرآن هدى للناس. Fruitful tips for Ramadan. The eyesight of Imam Bukhari, رحمه الله. When Imam Bukhari was three years of age, he lost his eyesight. So Imam Bukhari's mother promised herself that she would pray. Lots of the Hajjus Salah until Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala restores her son's eyesight. So she prayed and prayed the Hajjud every night until one night in a dream, she saw Ibrahim alayhi salam give her the good news that Imam Bukhari's eyesight had been restored. She ran to her son, and when he awoke. He found himself with vision again. It's important for us to understand that the mother did not go into a state of hopelessness or helplessness after her young child lost his eyesight. She wanted her son to serve Islam, and she made lots of du'a for him. She knew very well the power of du'a. She knew the beauty that lies in praying the Hajjul Salah. She knew Allah comes down to the lowest heaven, asking His servants to make du'a to Him at this time. Her taqwa, her strong conviction in Allah's power, gave her the strength to pray the Hajjul Salah. It means one has to sacrifice their sleep, their rest, and I know it is tough to leave your cozy bed. When we read about the life of Imam Bukhari or know what his contribution. To Islamic history and education is, we should pay tribute to his mother, also who was a widow, but she devoted herself to Allah and raised her son alone with the help of Allah Almighty. Please remember that du'a is not a small thing, but is a really big thing. This Ramadan, do not let your tongue rest, but ask Allah day and night. And see his blessings on you. Also, serve your parents and let them make dua for you. So for now, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.